Still many questions tonight on the best way to bridge the gap between police and young people, particularly young people of color. Chelsea Withers joins us now in the studio with a closer look at one local effort with plenty of potential where kids and cops can be pals. It's good news tonight at 5, Chelsea. The Police Athletic League, or what is better known as PALS, looks to not only give local kids an outlet to enjoy the outdoors, but also create a safe place for kids to learn about police work. Changes were made, so this way there wasn't any strikeouts. When it comes to kicking off this year's PALS program. It's cool that we can still play and do what we still did when the coronavirus wasn't a thing, so... It's actually really exciting to do. Typically, kids would join in on a week-long camp, but due to COVID-19, this year there will be smaller groups who are brought to the Boys and Girls Club. While there is fun to be had, this camp also looks to be a key part in helping the relationship between the police force and the community, especially during times like this. It does give these kids and a familiar face and to, to go to in the community. Um, not even necessarily if something's wrong. It was just even patrolling. Kids will come up to your car when they recognize you and just, just come up and talk to you. Um, and I think that, that's huge. Not only do the kids have someone new to recognize, but they also gain understanding of who they are. At first, I was kind of nervous. And then when I started just to chill and learn about them, it would actually be really cool to learn about officers and understand they don't just, they, they don't just arrest people, they're good people. If we grow older and we learn about the officers as much as we do now, um, we could become one of them. And it's not just the kids who are learning something. I think that the officers a lot of times get as much out of this as the kids do. You know, we get to know the kids a little bit better and, you know, their lifestyles and uh, the different cultures they come from. And it, uh, it helps us understand them better. Leading to a summer full of cheer. The PALS program will take place every Monday and Wednesday. Jill.